I have a motivation to easily manipulate a virtual object, a virtual scene, by my you know, uh, finger gesture. Most of the previous input device, multi-dimensional input device, sort of joystick, you know, push, pull, you know, twist. However, sometimes, you know, if the movement of your finger is the same direction of the object or the same direction of the virtual uh, camera you know, uh, view, then it seems very intuitive. So I tried to make a new kind of uh, uh, multi dimensional input device which allow the user to use the multiple finger gesture based 3D command. At that time I just uh, uh, developed a very primitive uh, three sensor based uh, input device which can allow you know, the three dimensional input command on the XYZ coordinate or cylindrical coordinate or semi uh, spherical coordinate. Uh, this is the Maya, uh, very fundamental design concept. When you think about navigation and control of an uh, uh, object or a uh, uh, camera view in the 3D environment, you have to uh, have a uh, uh, control freedom of X movement, Y movement, and Z movement. This is you know, one degree of freedom, another one degree of freedom, another one degree of uh, linear movement freedom. And also, you have to have a uh, freedom of rotation about the X, rotation about the Y, rotation about the Z. So, all of the freedom is up to six degrees of freedom. Once you have a capability to manipulate six degrees of freedom, you are, you know, flight everywhere. <laughs> so, this is the, you know, uh, uh, proof of concept how to generate six degrees of freedom input command under the XYZ coordinate. Then I installed three simple uh, sensors. It's basically just in a four-way switch. Then touch. Put a pressure-sensitive sensor will you know, uh, detect my direction of the finger touch. Then eventually that signal will generate to toward the uh, 3D command on uh, computer graphics. Based on this idea, uh, you know, those uh, alignment of uh, sensors and the resulting uh, finger movement will be mapped into the uh, mouse because mouse is the most popular and pervasive uh, input device right now. However, mouse is just you know, provide only two dimensional signal. So based on the mouse body, we like to add additional independent 3D input sensors to generate a uh, six degree of freedom uh, command. So that's why you know, those three buttons will be you know, installed on the surface body of the mouse. But we already developed you know, uh, the basic design concept of the hardware. However, in order to use the uh, 3D mouse, you have to find uh, appropriate or killer, killer 3D application. Mm -hmm. Otherwise, you know, even you have a 3D mouse, there's no way to use, enjoy the, you know, 3D you know, uh, navigation. So w one of my current uh, effort is to develop a universal interface driver for current and future uh, any kind of 3D commercial applica uh, software applications. And also, uh, we're uh, uh, some sort of a proprietary special uh, software project to utilize this mouse uh, more uh, fancy way, uh, you know, joyful way. Uh, it, it's, I cannot explain more detail, but, uh, you know, still Google, to apply the 3D mouse to the Google Earth is fine, very, uh, you know, comfortable to use. However, my belief is using this mouse, you will be able to develop much more exciting killer 3D application then we like to you know inter develop and introduce combined with this hardware input device so it's a bundle of that you know, packages user immediately enjoy wow amazing 3d world and now we can you know, w walk through flight through you know this kind of things so we cannot wait for you know uh, uh, the slow movement of uh, uh, 3d internet you know producers in you know, uh, attitude 
Sandio itself is going to provide clear application with 3D mouse. Then you know user can immediately enjoy their own 3D you know, virtual world. One of the reasons Microsoft introduced the Windows Vista is uh, to allow very simple, quick way to develop the 3D graphics application world you know, uh, using their uh, new script language of XAML. All of previous Windows uh, operating system is a uh, sort of uh, text-based, very, very old uh, structure. Because uh, the Windows uh, NT version 1 is uh, based on the you know, text-based uh, you know, user interface. Then Microsoft add uh, some uh, you know, graphics application interface and by some sort of patchwork, patch, second patch, third patch. So it's a, eventually it's a huge, amazing you know, operating system with a tons of uh, a graphics API patch. So it is very hard for the graphics programmer to develop a, a realistic 3D applications under uh, Windows XP. The Microsoft knows this is not optimal uh, operating system in terms of graphics presentation. So Microsoft developed a new kind of operating system from scratch. That was the uh, Windows Vista. Windows Vista provide uh, WPF, Windows Presentation Foundation mm -hmm. package. This is very, very powerful and very, very easy to use uh, 3D graphics application uh, tool. Using this tool, we are going to you know, introduce a uh, very uh, photorealistic program, very in a short time period, with a low labor f you know, fee. We have a midterm plan to introduce this kind of you know, 3D mouse for the Mac as well as Linux. Uh, however, as you know, the Windows <laughs> they dominated 90% of the market, so our mm -hmm. uh, focus is Windows first, then move to the second place. Because uh, we are the startup company, so mm -hmm. we don't have enough uh, human resources right now, so we focus on Windows first.